Welcome back to North Dakota Today. Nearly 90 area veterans were called up this weekend for one final mission. Their tour of duty to see the memorials in our nation's capital that are dedicated to them. So the honor flight of North Dakota and Minnesota is a whirlwind two-day trip to D.C. And our very own Lisa Boudot is on this trip making some memories to share the veteran stories. The honor flight is considered to be a trip of a lifetime, and it's definitely a trip to be shared with loved ones. Most of them brought friends or family to share this experience. Harvey Polkrebeck brought his grandson, who followed in his footsteps and also served in the Army. We also talked to Harold Jordheim, who now lives in Fargo. He brought his daughter, who lives in Grand Forks, and a niece met them in D.C. And I'm just tickled to death to have her along. It's her first trip to Washington, D.C. Everything is new. Oh, it's absolutely more special to do it with my dad. I think it would be special to do with anybody, just seeing the reaction of the crowd that didn't know us personally, but just to see the, the respect and the honor that they gave to all of these guys is just so heartwarming. Best welcome I've had, I went overseas for 17 months. I never even had a horn blow for me when I come back. Now the whole works turns out for me. I just love it. The Jordheims, like everyone on this trip, took a lot of pictures so they can bring back these experiences to their loved ones who didn't get to make the trip. From Washington, D.C., Lisa Badeau, Valley News Live. Great stuff, and what an amazing experience. My yeah. granddad got to go on one of those first honor flights they had. Really? And he said it was amazing. So wow. good news is the vets are expected to ride back in Fargo tonight around 8 o'clock. People encouraged to go out and check out as the veterans return home and give them a hero's welcome. Also, remember to stay with us here on Valley News Live. You're going to be able to see more of Lisa's coverage on the honor flight on Valley Today. I'm hoping starting tomorrow morning. Starting tomorrow morning, I'm pretty sure. I'm excited to hear what she has to say. Okay, it'll be interesting. So coming up on today's show is nine designers, three rooms, and 24 hours. We're getting a peek at a design challenge that you won't want to miss.